What is the GOAT of wrestling games? Whenever you ask this question, you hear two titles in particular, WWF No Mercy and SmackDown. Here comes the pain. With the revamp of the WWE 2K series starting with 2K22 and with 2K23 making a lot of improvements, I'm very optimistic about 2K24, specifically My Rise Mode. But to have a good reference to find out if WWE 2K24's My Rise Mode is truly great, we must revisit one of the most legendary career modes of all time, SmackDown. Here comes the pain. Here we go, boom, twist of it, boom! This game is insane. It's still good. It's still good, even in 2024. Did you come for another beating? Oh, Jesus. Oh, yeah! I got some friends! Who the f*** are you? Why are you just standing over there, Grim? Come over here and kick, and kick his ass? Join in? Just watch. Ooh, we gotta join in. Let's, let's stomp him. Yeah, that's right. Take him down. Take him down. Take him down. Whoa, what's this? What is this? What was that? Whoa, we went out- Even you'll get some. Yeah! Oh, Sable got me a little gift here! What'd you get me, Sable? Hi there, Grim. Can I talk to you? What'd you get me? What'd you buy me? Well, actually, I wanted to give you this pie I baked. She baked me a pie? And it would be really mean a lot to me if you could try some after your match. Uh-oh. Which pie are we talking about? Gotcha. <laughs> 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 They actually put that in the game, bro! <laughs> this game's legitimate, bro! Now this is the game of- <laughs> This is the game of the year, baby! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about! That's what I'm talking about! Which pie are we talking about here? What did you just say? All these games start off the same. You make your character, but the creation suite is surprisingly versatile for a game that's over 20 years old. When you begin career mode, you can pick which brand you want to start off in, SmackDown or Raw. And then the game becomes like Fallout. What I mean by that is the dialogue options in this game are so out there, man. They're shocking, hilarious, and they just give you so much freedom in this game. SmackDown Here Comes the Pain doesn't take itself too seriously, and that's what makes it great. Thank you very much, Lita. Let me ask you a question. Go on. Don't you think I'm a lot more attractive than Sable? Take a look. Stare at her body or look away. I'm gonna stare at her body. I mean, what's going on here? Ah, oh, hi, Sable! Uh, we weren't doing anything. I was just looking at her body like I looked at yours. Stare at her body. <laughs> I love this game, man. I fucking love this game. Stare at her body. Oh, mama. That's what I'm talking about. Sweet Jesus. Um, what are you looking at? I'm starting to get a little worried here. Get the hell out of here. Like it or not, I'm his manager, not you. Ooh. It's okay, Sable. Nothing could ever separate you and me. What the hell was that all about? Grim? I'll tell you, this is the best job in the world. Anyway, let's bring out our lovely contestants tonight, starting with Lita. Yeah. Stay calm, everyone. Stay calm. <gasps> oh! 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 Oh my, I can't stand it. All right, let's let Grim decide who the winner is. King, get a hold of yourself. <laughs> Look at me there, what the fuck? So Grim, who do you think is the winner tonight? Sable wins or Lita wins, who wins guys? Sable is victorious. Hey, stop getting too close to each other. Oh, Grim's coming in, I'm coming in. I'm glad you were here to support me, Grim. Thank you so much. Give her a hug. Oh, now what's happening here? Hey, you get away from the Sable. This is not appropriate. After a match, you can taunt, attack, or respect your opponent, all with surprise outcomes. Here I go to attack Rico, but he ends up whooping my ass instead. By God, you son of a bitch, Grim Hollywood. Wait, what? What? What the fuck? Before I get into the legendary gameplay of Here Comes the Pain, which is the standout feature of this game, there's a backstage mode you can go to and talk to all these other wrestlers, each with their own different outcome. Here I start a rivalry with Undertaker, who is wildly insulting. You are. 
Then you show me the proper respect, and I let you walk away. Or I can hunt you down. I will inflict more pain on you than you thought was physically possible. I will make you suffer! So what I want to know now is, what's it gonna be, punk? Is it gonna be the easy way? Or the hard way. Show him respect, be defiant. Then he backs it up and whoops me in the ring. Oh my god. Dude, he's just oh my god. Yeah, whoa. I should have I should have given you respect. I should have given you respect. No! No, 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 no! Wait, 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 wait! No! Fuck! No! Oh, why is my why am I like that, bro? No! What the fuck? So we go up to Brock, and he just knocks me out. Bring it on. Here comes the pain. He said the game name! Oh! See, this game walks the line between being extreme and off the wall, but it's grounded at the same time. It's never too goofy or too crazy. It's just perfect. The gameplay reflects this as well. Well, this is closer to a fighting game, man, with the counters and stuff. The simulation titles? Like, they, they're more like Sims now. And they, they took away that sort of fun element in the games. Like, this feels... This feels fun as hell, man. Wrestling and Here Comes the Pain is so much fun, man. The moves have the right impact. They don't necessarily look like they do on TV. It's no simulation, and that's what makes it awesome. The problem with modern-day wrestling games, and don't get me wrong, I've pre-ordered 2K24, baby, Deluxe Edition, but what they're missing is a dash of Here Comes the Pain with the animations and the physics. When you go full simulation, you lose a dash of a little bit of that magic. Wah, boom! Now, after playing 2K24 yesterday on stream, the gameplay is slick, and I do think they have accomplished putting a little more splash into the moves. It's still simulation, but the moves themselves look a little better than they did in 2K23. But it's still missing that magic factor that made Here Comes the Pain gameplay legendary. But we are here to compare the career modes, right? So the big flaw in 2K24's My Rise mode is that you have to win every fight. Now you can say, get good skill issue, and you're probably right. What the f***, bro? Oh my god, I just lost. No way! So in this game, if you lose... Oh, come on, man. If you lose the match, you straight up lose. You straight up lose the story mode. In SmackDown, here comes the pain. If you lose, it just goes on your record. You just, the game keeps going if you lose. But at the same time, it takes the immersion away from the game when you can't continue past a match. This isn't showcase mode, right? This is career mode. So when games from over 20 years ago had programmed this mechanic in, the idea that your story can continue and go on even deeper branching paths because you lost against, say, Undertaker, that's exciting. This isn't showcase mode like I was saying where it's understandable that you have to win to progress, right? This is career mode, and in every wrestler's career they lose matches. It's the biggest flaw and letdown in this year's My Rise mode, especially when these old PS2 games did it better. Now they did a little backstage thing similar to Here Comes the Pain, and with actual voiceovers, which is a nice touch, albeit the writing is, um, yeah. Just, and I don't want to overstep here, but I have just one little thing I'm bumping on. What's that? It's just that I would rather have my fingernails pulled out with needle nose pliers than ever work for an entitled, condescending reality show hack like you. And it's cool to see Regal coaching your guy, but it's just so dry, man. It's lacking flavor, baby. Thank you, sir. So much. <laughs> I'll bring my best. Good man. Thank you, sir. I'll see bring you my do. best. I'll do my best, sir. Thank you very much. I'm so excited. You're the long shot of this whole night, my boy. Thanks, man. Compare these career mode intros here. This is the My Rise intro. Both Raw and SmackDown. Raw GM William Regal Are you guys Cody listening to any of this? I'm not first soaking any of this shit he in. was confident the title would be coming to Raw. But SmackDown's brand new general manager, The Miz, didn't find this awesome. He called the attempt to take his WWE Universal Championship to Raw nothing short of theft. Raw's GM is going to make a match on the SummerSlam kickoff show for that last slot in the tournament. Your guy, Kevin Owens. I mean, I wouldn't call him my guy. Your guy is not going to know his opponent until the winner of that match, and neither will we. That is rough. That was very rough. And this is Here Comes the Pain intro. Please ask me, why do you wrestle? 
I ask myself the same question every morning, feeling the pain, but I do it for so many reasons. The rush of adrenaline, the roar of the crowd, the glory of the championship, but I know there is more to it. Maybe I'm doing this to find an answer. Maybe when I get to the top of this squared circle, I'll find- I- maybe I won't find out anything! But I guess... I'll step into that ring again tonight, because I know the view from in there is... UNBELIEVABLE! Badass. I mean, you can see the difference, right? Graphically, 2K24 is obviously superior, but the soul, man, belongs to Here Comes the Pain, and that's what's really missing from these modern-day wrestling titles is soul. Now, don't get me wrong, I am excited for 2K24. I think that 2K is putting this franchise back on the right tracks. I mean, after all, we do have the best Twitch wrestling show in the game, Los Angeles Wrestling. That's... that's... that's gonna be... that's gonna be... Butterfly what? Carnage! That's gonna be Butterfly Carnage! Viscerating! Oh! 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 Somebody get a ref! Somebody get a... But I think... To hold a standard is truly important to find out if My Rise mode is going to be as good as the season mode in Here Comes the Pain. If you haven't played this great title, you gotta check it out. It still holds up today. How are you all doing tonight? Good, I hope. With 2K24 pretty much being out right now, what are your thoughts on it all? Do you enjoy the direction this franchise is going? Do you like the simulation style? Do you think that 2K24 is borrowing from the past great games a little bit? Or, do you think that the franchise could really benefit from putting a little bit of pain in it? I want to hear about it. Much love, and as always, as always, as always, thank you for keeping a little Hollywood in your heart. I'm in New York and we finna get loose Squeeze the big apple and give me the juice Don't wanna talk, I just do what it do 